Welcome back, everybody. This is Don't Starve, Reign of Giants. I am your ever-present idiot host, Notion of Oceans. Let's try to figure some stuff out. See if we can't die. Let's make another... I need more sticks and stuff. Okay, so on our last episode, we had a lot of excitement. A little more than usual, but, you know, nothing crazy. And today, I guess we're just going to set up some more drying racks and get some of our newly acquired uh, rabbit meat up and uh, drying out. Nope. I'm a little too full. Yeah, hold that, Chester. Okay, so some new things for me last night, uh, that whole little, that whole thing, quite an odd experience, I'm gonna, I'm gonna say, never had anything quite like the pigmen running at me, trying to murder my face, one where six, I'm gonna set up, I'm actually gonna go ahead and set up two more. So yeah, this is third day of the Great Snow Inn. Uh, it's all really melting right about now, but there's still some more forecasted in the uh, forecast. Uh, well, at least my weather app says so. It, it seems like it's not going to, to be honest. Uh, roads will be clear by then. So we'll see how much further I get into this stuff with... Uh, so little in the way of uh, impetus. I'm sure we'll be fine, though. Okay, let's go ahead and make those new drying racks. Put one right here. Shooty boots. Oh well, I got it. In the end, it all worked out. And now with these extra drying racks, I can murder El Rabbito and set some meat to dry. So, I wonder what our next thing's gonna be. Uh, like, where are we going? What am I doing? Everything seems to be going pretty well. Nothing really crazy going on. Uh, as I recall, we already made some stuff. Uh, oh, hey, I can make a siesta lean to. Okay, I've never seen one of those, so I guess we can try for that. I don't even know what that would look like, to be honest. Uh, go ahead and give me that wood and those pine cones. I'll plant some later so I can set up a little tree farm, but I think for now that's pretty good. Let's uh, get some food in the fire. Evidently you can use these as like helps, like add-ons to your normal stuff. Not sure how well it works. But, uh, we'll see how it happens. I mean, I have faith. Really clear out Chester of anything that can uh, go bad. Put it inside of the uh, chest while we're at it. Yeah, okay. So, I'm going to put that, uh, that, and two of you. Let's see what happens. That would be pretty interesting. Looks like it's about to be night, so let's just add these pine cones on them. Oh, crap. Well, I mean, at least we can go out and grab some stuff. 
Let's see, I was working towards the Fiesta Lumi series, so... I guess all I really need is, like, wood and some other stuff. Wood and... Eh. Just chop down a couple trees, I guess. Uh, we'll see what happens. Um, so my girlfriend came back today. Uh, she's not been here in a while. Uh, stayed close to her, closer to her work, you know, in case things got as hairy as they did. And, you know, they did. So I guess that worked out for the best. Uh, so I'm very happy to have her back. Uh, she's very excited about me recording again. Uh, a rather limited experience of recording happened mostly last year around this time. I didn't really stick with it. I was going to, but um, I just had problems keeping to it. It's probably the hardest thing, just keeping with it. But I never like put anything on YouTube, so it's not like I can be, you know, oh, I did all the things. But, uh, you know, we'll see what happens. It ought to be fine. Ought to be fine. Let's make a uh, fistful of jam since we're not doing so well. This is a relatively quick and easy uh, recipe you can do. It's just four pieces of jam. And uh, make some really fast food that uh, will fill you up. And it gives you a heck of a lot of health, if I recall, but it doesn't look like it did. Let's see what we get out of this. Let's make sure to put all the food items in there. Uh, okay, let's try to make this Fiesta Lumi series. Four boards, three of those. How many boards? Four. Okay. Four boards. Three, um... Three of, uh, the other things. Okay, so... Whenever I place my traps, I usually will do it right over the hole, and that's just so I can make sure that I have... that I'm actually catching the rabbit. Because I really have a hard time with it. I've been told that Reign of Giants has better, like, rabbits, but, I mean, I haven't really seen anything to suggest such a thing. Like, better AI for the rabbit, so they're not quite as dumb, but, uh, I don't know, I, don't, I haven't had any problems. It remains to be seen. Okay, probably just keep this guy back here. We'll have that last little board. Actually, I'm going to need more wood than that. Because uh, it was four boards, I'm pretty sure. So just a couple more. Probably just chop down this birch nut tree. It'll work out. They remind me a lot of the um, trees from that... Um, oh, what is it? That Dr. Seuss story about um, conservationism and consumerism. Oh, the Lorax. That's it. They remind me of the trees from the Lorax. They really do. They're big and puffy. I don't know. But, um, yeah, I guess I'll get a, uh, like a shovel together at some point and I'll put that together and see what happens with that. Oh! Ice swing o -matic. That's weird. Hmm, I don't even know what you would use that for, to be honest. I don't know. That's weird. I don't know. I'm going to make this Fiesta Loom too, though. We're going to see what that is. 
There has to be like a place where you sleep. Where it's too hot? I don't know. That's weird. I don't think it'll be, you know, fantastically good for me to stay there, but, you know. We'll see, I guess. Can I even make a shovel? No, shovel's still locked. Should probably unlock that. Also get a pitchfork. Uh, so with a pitchfork, you can dig up turf, which doesn't seem like a fantastic thing, but it can let you change out like where your farms and things are because grass usually grows best in the savanna areas, while trees and um, like twigs and stuff tend to grow better in like these light forested areas. So it's really just for crop things like that. So you can also just dig up the turf and burn it. It's actually a pretty good fire source. And if you're trying to like plan things out on your base. I don't know. I need to make some chests. I've been seriously lacking in my chest building. Go ahead and eat all those. Uh, we'll probably cook something. Let's take some monster meat and that, and some carrots. Mm, put the seed in there. Yeah, okay, there we go. Now I'll put in a couple of those single piece of monster meat and that bit of jerky. Nope. That was unhelpful. Okay. Um, it's not like the most hugely helpful item. But I usually have one just in case. Huh. What's this? Spicy chili. Huh. Let's just eat it and see what happens. Oh, that's a big one. Oh. Yeah, it usually takes about a day for a morsel like that to um, finish up. Yeah, about a day normally for a morsel of meat like that. Um, it takes a couple of extra days for things like the... Uh, Takes a couple of extra days for the uh, like big pieces of meat to dry, but you know, every little bit helps. It's the best thing to really do that because it extends your meat into <laughs> the far flung future. Oh, that was not that was not a well thought out analogy. I'm gonna say. Let's just go ahead and pick up some carrots. See what happens with that. I guess get this monster meat in there too. And I guess the birch nuts, because we can cook those. So I'm pretty sure that at one point there was like a weird haze on my screen, and I think that was my character getting too hot. So I guess that may be a thing, even though that doesn't make much sense, all considering when he's a uh, when he's a robot. But I guess you got to take some and, you know, you can't be 100% into it all the time. So yeah, I'm going to make a run for those uh, spiders, that big spider den. Maybe chop down some trees to make a log suit. I don't even know what I'd need for that. Probably like some, let's see, in combat, I need two ropes and eight logs. So I think I'm going to make that first and then go into battle. Really helps you uh, lower the uh, amount of damage you take in big fights like that. So I think I'm going to do that. Let's see. 
a log. So I took the old Axamaroo, just chop some of these guys down. Well, let's see if there's any more silk or gears that I can get, because, you know, I don't really know what happens when you upgrade higher and higher with the gears and stuff. So, like, I don't know if there's, like, a max you can go to, so I'm, I kind of want to play around with that. And plus, since there's so many more chances to actually kill the pawns and bishops and stuff, and the knights, um, you know, might as well, while we're at it. That sounds really dark and bitter. I don't know. Just the way that it's supposed to be. The way I'm trying to put everything together is just like, hey, as long as they're there, I might as well experiment. I mean, the thing is, I don't want to die on day 12. Let's murder that guy. Put him in there. Let's grab him. Murder him. Drop the trap back down. Oh, I got a pomegranate. Sure. Well, since they're a, a convenient seed right there, might as well. So yeah, everything's looking good right now. We're doing really well. So let's make that log seat. Uh, actually, I haven't looked at this any. Let's see if there's anything new. Uh, tooth trap scale mail. Oh, weather pane. That is an odd thing. I've never really heard of that before. Never seen it. So let's just make a log suit so that we can battle some beasties. And uh, it's getting kind of late. I'm not sure. I may want to just like kill some guys. Yeah, grab this little extra morsel. Every little bit helps. Especially because this guy seems to just run out really fast. I don't know if it's just me or... Oh, there's a hole there. Actually, why don't I get some more stuff for traps? That'd probably be smart. Grab more sticks and more grass. Let's go ahead and clear this place out of grass. You have any? You have any grass in you, Chester? No. Unhelpful. Mediocre. Sorry. That's just the one time I've ever really, like, been talking, and I could use that Mad Max reference. It works really well, but I've never been able to use it before. So, I guess you guys got it. I don't know. Huh, that seemed like a slightly smaller one than usual. Let's just go ahead. There. Oh, oh. Pig. Man, I'm glad they didn't wander in my camp during the full moon. Jesus. Jeez, oh Pete, that'd have been bad. Bad day. Oh, there's some more. We're straying a little far afield, but, you know, I think we can get back in the time that we've got. Okay, I think we have enough for, like, four of those. Yeah, okay. We'll just grab two more, and we can make two more traps. And we'll have enough spares left over that we can put together some new stuff. Oh, I'll grab a mushroom, I guess. Mm. Uh, time, time does not stop for any man or beast, I guess. So let's just go ahead and make one, and I guess. Or that and you grab this. Set it up right here. Go ahead and make another one too. 
set it up on that one that's kind of close to camp. Yeah, that one right there. We'll set it up right there. We'll have all kinds of food coming in. Looks like it's about time to start the fire up. I don't know. I use like pine cones and stuff whenever I don't have wood. That's usually what I do. Just in my idea, it's probably the best item to use for the job. Uh, okay, I'll take that. Oh. You go ahead and hang one up here. So I'll cook you. Cook you. And, uh. Oh, wait. Chester has a morsel in him. I can use that. Hopefully it'll make something that's not deadly, deadly to eat. I guess here's hoping. Fingers crossed. Oh, he falls. Yes. Perfect. Now the best thing that I know of to make, as far as food goes, is a meaty stew, which takes usually about three of these um, big pieces of meat to make. And uh, you get those primarily by doing the hunt, as I call it, where um, you hunt the koala fin, which is this cute little creature that you can uh, track down and find during the day and murder horribly for its uh, sweet, sweet flesh. But uh, if I happen to come across it while I'm going towards uh, the spider dens, I may actually run down there and I may actually run after it and try to get some more meat. Because right now, we're not hurting for food, but eventually there's going to be seasons where there's not as much just sort of free range grabbing I can do. So the best idea in that case is really to just, you know, try to get stuff. I could set up some bee boxes, but um, I still don't really know how those work. Like, I've built a couple of them, and it just sort of ends up going bad for me in the end. So I don't know. Well, I'll see about it. Because, you know, that's just another piece of food I can get. Oh, it looks like they just totally murdered all of them. Okay. Well, let's equip this. Get my spear out. See if I can't knock a couple of these down. Let's see, come on. A little further. Okay. That's a good haul for the first one. Come on. Come on. Try to bust up some of these. Geez, there are so many of them. It's never good to have um, these guys just hanging around. It always ends bad for you. Woo! Smooth moves, man. I'm destroying it right now. Man, I'm just the king right now. Come on. Come on. Oh, it looks like they're alerted, I guess. Woo! I'm just ripping them apart. Woo, come on. Yes, 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 yes. Okay. Come on. Come on, little boy. Yes! I'm just ripping these guys apart. Dang, there are so many of them. I wonder if this is like a new biome type. Oh, hey! Hey, that's one of the uh, secret characters. 
that you can randomly find in the world. So if I do it right, I should be able to, if I open up a grave and bury the uh, skull here, I should be able to actually get a new character for later. Come on, keep coming. So I don't know how far the radius is, because normally it's just as long as you get out of the, um, out of like the field, I guess. I don't know. And I have no clue why there were so many before. Wow, I'm lucky that there weren't any more of them. I have no clue what that noise was, and I'm a little afraid. But hey, Spider Buster XL right here, right? I mean, come on, that was fantastic. That was beyond anything I've done before in this game. Come on, Chester, let's try to get back home before it gets too dark. I should be able to. I'll just hop on the path. Man, I hate it when it gets dark and you're trying to use a path because you just can't see. It's just the worst. Whew, those moles are freaking me out. But yeah, uh, I guess I'll travel to the uh, graveyard, dig up a grave and bury his head. Uh, I think that's how you do it. I'm pretty sure that's how it works. I think I read that somewhere. Because, you know, I mean, I don't think it's cheating to read about characters you can get while you're in Reign of Giants. Because I'm pretty sure there's only two. And it's Weber there. And uh, a girl called, like, Wolfgrid or Wongrind or something. I'm not really sure how you say her name. But um, suffice it to say, it's a very odd name. Man, all this monster meat. I don't know what I'm going to do with it. It's almost useless in cooking, as far as I can remember. Luckily, it does that. It, like, prioritizes the meat over the, um, over the trap. So as long as you kill them, you can always do this. It's a problem that I often have, because I never really end up leaving enough space in my inventory for all the stuff that I have. Whew, I am, I'm racking it up. I'm actually doing pretty well. Here, Chester, you have some bees. Let's uh, plant something new. And uh, throw all the rest of them in here. And I'll use this in my next recipe. I need to get some more food, but um, I guess as long as I have that. Actually, let's save the uh, jerky and just go with uh, like normal meat since we have so much of it. Let's just go double meat. Hopefully this will make some nice uh, meatballs. I guess we'll see. And it's getting kind of close to night and I have very little to burn. Oh, this is a bad idea. Okay. Um, I guess worst case scenario, I have these twigs. Do you have anything in you I can burn? Oh yeah, you can burn manure and it works as a pretty okay fire source. Uh, it's not great by any means, but I guess in a bind, it works pretty well. So I guess tomorrow I will run over there and I'll keep murdering um, spiders. Because you need webs and stuff for everything. As long as I'm not murdering all of them. Yeah, it makes a little poop cloud. Uh, as long as I'm not murdering all of them, I assume it'll be fine. Okay, uh, just store all of that. I'm going to prioritize the actual good meat against the crappy monster meat. Even though I'm going to have a lot more of it than anything else by the end of this. 
let's see. Uh, where were the graves at? Uh, oh, down there. Okay, yeah. I'll just uh, pop on down there and do that so I can unlock the character. So it's just, uh, yeah, it's just straight down. Okay, should be pretty quick. A little quick diversion before we go spider hunting with your greatest of great spider hunters here. Oh man, I was not expecting to find, um, I really wasn't expecting to unlock any of the characters yet. It's kind of quick. I mean, it remains to be seen if I actually, you know, if it matters, but Weber's pretty cool. Um, that'd be pretty interesting. Equip that. Never good for your sanity to grab stuff like that, but you get little weird, interesting items out of it, so I think it's worth it. Okay. Let's bury the skull. Oh. Oh. Oh, God. Oh, God. Run. Run for your life. Well, Weber is a friend to um, spiders, so I guess that makes sense. Oh god, I'm going crazy. I gotta grab some flowers on my way while I'm running. I was not ready for that. I did not know that happened. Oh my god, this stuff is just crazy. Just, ah, don't need that. I need flower petals. I'm going nuts here. I wish you could plant flowers, because I'm pretty sure like you have to plant your bee boxes and stuff around a lot of flowers if you want to make any kind of like headway with them. Because they produce honey, which you can just sort of easily harvest, even if the bees don't like it too much. Um, yeah, they don't like it any. I hope that big caravan of spiders isn't coming for me. I don't have any space. Chester, hold this. And this. Gotta reposition that trap. It's crappy trap placement. As is that, but it'll be fine. It'll probably catch one. Murder, murder, murder. Murder, murder, murder. Dang, that wasted way too much of my day. I'm never going to be able to make it. And I don't have any wood. Okay, so, got to make a quick wood run. Get some stuff for a fire. So we can at least survive the night. You can burn a log suit, but, I mean, it's kind of dumb. I need a log suit more than I need any of this other stuff, so... Especially if I'm going to be Spider Buster. Ah, crap. Do I have enough to make another one? I don't. Okay. Chester, hold that. Thanks. That's all I need from you, guy. Make another axe. So let's chop some more. Oh. Ah, man, I hate it when it does that. When you're just like one chop away, it's the worst thing. But you know, it's better to have some than none. So I guess that works out. Yep, come on, grab it. If you hold the uh, pickup button, so you usually just run around and grab everything. Uh, I believe that's space bar on the normal. Yeah, I believe it's space bar in the normal setup with the keyboard. Man, that was a big one. Okay, that should be enough. Okay, so things are looking up. After a rocky start with getting Weber's skull to him, uh, tonight's looking pretty good. I just gotta decide what I'm gonna do. Like I said I was gonna do the uh, spider busting, but not sure how much my Hulk suit can work out for that. Uh, I guess let's just add a couple of uh, couple of these. Grab uh, well, store the rest of them. 
grab the monster main. Um, grab that. Oh. Well, screw you, Tin Man. Okay, I really need to work this out. Uh, put you in there. A lit torch will be in Jester's mouth from now on. Uh, not sure how that's going to work out. Seems like a bad idea. And one monster meat. We'll cook that up. Store everybody, uh, store everybody back. Uh, oh, got some more jerky. Get some more morsels for that. Take that. Get Chester. Take that. Drop these back. Grab those. Drop them back. Okay. Whew. Item management. The game. Thrilling commentary. But I guess you don't really come here for the thrilling commentary. You come here to uh, support the community, I guess. I don't know what anybody does here. Okay. So do I have enough for a chest? I need three boards. Got enough for one. Oh, fantastic. You got any in you? No. I didn't store any in here. And you can't. Whew. So I guess we're just waiting for a bit. I wonder if a siesta lean to is just like a cheaper tent. Because I know you can sleep through the night in a tent. Using a tent, you can sleep through these sections, and it fully restores your sanity. Normally, gets a lot of your health back, but it drains your stomach. Something fierce, I'm gonna tell you. So really, you should only do it if you have something to fully restore your health, your stomach at least. Uh, I'm actually gonna go ahead and make some more, I guess, while I'm at it. Whew. Sorry, that was the. Uh, that was the cat. Had to shoo him away. Uh, oh. There we go. And it doesn't help me 100%. Man. What a bust. Okay. Did I grab the meat? Is the meat on the ground? Where's the meat? There's the meat. Okay. Let's go ahead and get that going. Oh, a durian. That's cool. I don't know what I'm going to do with a durian. But, you know. I can store it. Get some more items popping in the old... In there. Uh, pop them back in there. Grab this. Whew, my inventory is a mess. I am going to have to go and cut down some more trees. I'm going to have to. Man, this umbrella sucks. I thought this would work better. Man. Get good with the umbrella. I guess it just slows it. Uh, that sucks, though. I mean, I thought it would at least work out more. Let's uh, let's go ahead and put all the stuff together to make a chest while we're out here. Fantastic. I've got to. I've got too much crap in my inventory right now. Carry that. Uh, carry those. Carry the poop in your mouth. It's the only place I ever put poop. Whenever I have it with Jester. Okay, so that's plenty. Plenty of food for the fire, um, a chest. That doesn't make any sense. Let's go ahead and chop down a couple more, I guess. Try to get something going. Okay, I got enough for an extra board, which is the knife. Let's go ahead and pick some stuff while I'm out and about. Get together 
all the items I need for some extra traps. Maybe I will make a couple bee boxes up and around here. I mean, it would be a pretty good spot for it. Maybe grab some. Yeah, you don't actually have to have the petals in your inventory. It's actually just the... Like, it's just the um, act of grabbing them that restores your sanity. So it's actually pretty effective like that. So you can just grab them, I guess. Uh, makes a little bit of rot. Okay. I think we're good for now. The days are really lengthening out. And, um... I'm not really sure what's up with that. It's a little worrying. Because I know that normally in, like, the normal mode, winter starts up at about day 16. But I thought there was more... I thought there were more seasons. So... Not really sure. Very odd thing. Oh well. At least I got plenty of berries, plenty of everything else right now. Probably gonna be the last time I have most of this stuff. At least if. I mean, at least if um, winter kicks in, that's for sure. Oh, yeah. Um, okay, I'm gonna build a chest. I've got to. I've got no place to put anything. Um, how about here? Okay, so I can just put some of this crap in here. These items that I don't ever, that I don't need to walk around with. Just. Oh wait, I need that. Okay, that's a little more orderly, I guess. Uh, it's not 100%, but it's better than nothing. Okay. Ah, uh, this one's about to die. Well, not the rabbit. The rabbit is going to die, but I meant the trap. Traps lose durability over time. Every time they catch one, they lose a chunk of durability. So, yeah. But hey man, I'm in a good area for it at least. I got that above anything else. So that's three more. Um, this one doesn't seem to be catching rabbits anymore, so I may need to reposition it. Yeah, there we go. Okay. Well oh, hey, some of my uh, morsels turned into stuff. So I'll just go ahead and dry the new stuff on here. Shouldn't really do that. As a man with quite a bit of experience as far as janitorial supplies go, and items of a food nature, I should really go with um, uh, last, last out, first in. Last in, first out. Or something like that. I forget. There's a slogan for it. I don't know what it's about. I'm very confused, as you can tell. Okay. So we'll do another piece of monster meat. And another one of those. And uh, let's just check the map a little bit. Uh, don't even know really what to do right now. But um, I guess that all has to wait till tomorrow. Because right now, right now, it's time for me to go. I know. Parting is such sweet sorrow. I'll start the fire. Parting is such sweet sorrow. But uh, until next time, we're going to see how long this idiot can go without starving in Don't Starve. So, this is Notion of Oceans, signing off.